Good morning. Um, we are having IVIG today. I'm at my grandparents' house. That's the different background and better lighting. Uh, and it is currently 7.22. I, I'm scheduled for, sorry, make you guys nauseous, um, 8, eight in the morning. And um, we're going to see how it goes because I'm not going to be getting Benadryl today because I have rehearsal later and I don't want to be groggy. Um, yeah, it's going to be a, a long day, but I'm going to be studying my script and it's going to be good. My grandma's taking me. By the way, if I didn't say that. <gasps> Maggie! This is my dog growing up. Yeah, we gotta go. Bye, Maggie. Bye. Good morning. Say good morning. Good morning. I don't have makeup on. That's not fair. That's okay. <laughs> my, my, my mom uh, usually and I always vlog my uh, IVIG sessions. Oh, well you should have told me I would have been more prepared. That's okay. Um, let's see. What's, what's an update? I don't know. We're going to be on time, right? Probably. Yeah. Just got to the hospital. I'm waiting for my grandma. She had to park the car. <laughs> I always love this, the murals and everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you want me to count? No, it's okay. Okay. If, some, if somebody was really mean, they could like scream when you like just barely. Yeah. That'd be awful though. You'd probably have a heart attack. I would at least. I kind of like brace myself for that anyway. Yeah, like if they're I'm trying to not get your um, shirt and stuff. I'm gonna so right now we are running my what's the word? Hydrocard What's the steroid, Mimi? Uh, or solumendrol? Yeah, solumendrol whatever and fluids and then in 20 minutes we are going to start IVIG I feel okay it's kind of itchy probably because it's running kind of fast right now but um and I didn't get that drill today so I'm gonna see how it goes from my makeup for the pillow. Oh, uh, that kind of drama is so hard to put up with. I mean, yeah, it is. I Me. hate drama. Oh, I just don't have time in I was spilling the tea it. to my yeah. grandma. I just don't have time for it at this point in my... Yeah, drama is so ridiculous. Do you still have it at your age? Oh, yeah. I mean, you're 22, but... <laughs> we had drama in your 20s. Oh, okay. Oh, she called you back. Did she order new meds for you? Like yeah. a new prescription for her? Yeah. yeah. The way it's warning me on the computer, it's like she changed a prescription. 
There's a thing. Oh, she added something. Oh. Because, um, I yeah, found something new. And it's not something that I can, like, physically acknowledge here because it's not for here. So it's just, like, putting up a stop, which makes sense. But I can't do anything about it. She has to just fix that. Basically a reminder for her to look at it. Sorry. It's okay. Sometimes it happens, I'm like, oh, it's fine, and then it just starts. Well set. She did great. Yeah, I feel Wonderful. bad. Wonderful. I feel bad. You were like just doing nothing the whole time. But it's alright. I'm, I, glad, I don't I'm have, glad I wasn't alone. It's 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 just like the company. I don't have much opportunity to just do nothing so i'm very pleased <laughs> that's that's always what my mom says whenever we have infusions too she's like you know i don't really mind it because i don't it's a nice like, downtime yeah it's very hot outside yes it is what's the temperature 96 degrees wow Are 96 i don't know what happened to real. spring let's let's get the car moving and see it was sitting in the sun so i don't know degrees. that that's you really... live in connecticut what the heck i don't know if that's real that means it's going to be a crazy summer. Like, crazy. The hot dog cart. Love it. I got back from Target and I'm going to show you what I got because today's video is like a uh, IVIG but also like day vlog. And I was going to bring the camera in Target but I've never filmed in Target and... I don't know, I just didn't feel like it right now. Um, also, it's 92 degrees outside. Oh, what the heck. Okay, so first thing I got were um, uh, tights, white opaque tights because I needed them for the show. Um, I got a nude pair of underwear, also need for the show, and just this cute pair um, with kangaroos on them. I don't know why. Actually, Alton, this is your favorite animal, so got those for you. Just kidding. That was a joke. Um, and then I got one, two, three, five pairs of eyelashes. There are three in here. Um, I'm not going to wear them for the show, but I ran out recently of eyelashes, and these are kind of like a glamour ones. These are natural ones, and then these are luxe ones. So two elf and one Sonia Kashik, whatever. Okay. Before everyone judges me, I love Cinderella, and I'm a two-year-old, and I want to put this, like, on my vanity, or give it to my mom for her birthday because she was Cinderella in high school. I don't know. I just got it because I wanted to cuddle her because she's cute. Anyways, um, I got these for my mom for her birthday. She has a wallet with octopuses on them. Um, her birthday is on Cinco de Mayo. I got her some other stuff, too, um, like before but this is just to add on to her present um i got myself because i ran out of contour stuff um this little cream contour because i like cream contour uh from went wild and then i got this uh worth the hype mascara a nyx lip liner to match i think these are pretty close and they're not really now that I'm looking at them, but that's okay. Um, and then this balm stain for the show and a lip liner to match it. And then I got my boyfriend um, this for the show because his eyebrows are bushy. Just kidding. They're not really bushy, but um, he tried this once in my old show and used it. Because if you've never done theater, boys wear makeup too. And it's not... 
I mean, the ones that I've met, it's not their favorite thing in the world to do, but they have to do it anyway. So those are for you. Um, and then I got, <laughs> judge me with this too, but I got dinosaurs wearing sunglasses for my window and these little fruits um they were in the dollar section and if you've ever been to target you know the dollar section is amazing so yep that is my haul and uh yeah shout out to my nini for taking me found this nyx glitter that i picked up um it's in that whatever i don't know what that means but it just looked pretty and i wanted a loose glitter for my lid um makeup Heyo, it's Zo. Um, so I'm gonna be really real with y'all. Uh, you know, I was just like at Target, just like picking out stuff, and I was like, I feel like crap because I was going through what would fit me now and what wouldn't. And if you guys didn't know this already, um, I have struggled with eating disorder, eating disorders in the past. Um, and, you know, without getting too much into it, I just, I stopped checking my weight. And, like, the, the nurse today was like, LOL, step on the scale. And I was like, <laughs> I haven't checked my weight in about two months. Um, because how I actually got spiraled into recovery from my eating disorder was that my scale broke at home. And I haven't step, stepped on the scale, like two months and I stepped on it today and I saw a number that I didn't like and you know a part of my recovery is just not weighing myself not counting calories not thinking about it and I'm really nervous that knowing this number is going to spiral into my eating disorder again and I don't know why I just felt like I wanted to talk about it because you know this is the side of anorexia and of bulimia and of binge eating that we don't see is what it what it does to people and um you know for the longest time i didn't think i was gonna be able to get out of it and now to think that i could possibly you know get back into the, the negative and just bad mindset that i was in is really scary for me and i just I didn't i didn't have a good day you know people are really just annoying and i don't like drama and i don't like negativity and I get very um attacked really easily I feel really attacked um by things and I try not to be you know take things so personally but it's hard because I'm a person and just like I don't know just I have some health issues new ones going on of course and it's just like I just don't get a break and I'm just I don't know I feel really um bad about myself because of this number and um just because you know I, I nearly died at rehearsal not died that's dramatic but like I passed out once and I almost passed out another time and my director came to me yesterday and was like lol what do I do if this happens during a show and I don't I don't want to not get cast again you know and, and I want to be taken seriously not this sick girl you just let into the play and you're not going to let in again. <sighs> I don't know. I'm talking with a friend of mine right now and he, um, he's talking me through some stuff that I'm thinking right now and he knows who he is so I love you and thank you for everything and if you guys are watching this, just thank you for watching this, and, and um, I hope that me crying on camera wasn't weird. This is the first time I'm doing this, so, you know, it's new for both of us, but I love you guys, and uh, if you need anything, I'm always here. I'm going to continue with the vlog, hopefully, but I just, I just wanted to talk to you about some of the stuff that is going through my head, but. I do driving Nini. You did good. Tell the world that I did good. Okay. <laughs> she did wonderful. I was She's great. a great driver. I was a great driver. I'm Trust taking her with my life. Joy with my life. <laughs> I'm taking my test next <coughs> in two weeks.
came into the driveway. I was fresh out of shower. Can't even see you. Shadow. I drove here. Hello, spring or summer, whatever. Okay, so my day, I'm gonna fart. It's not coming out. If you just heard my fart, you're welcome. I have no shame. My boyfriend hasn't even heard me fart. Um, but now he can. Also, let's talk about boyfriends real quick. Okay, hold on, I need to find my headband. Um, if you have a boyfriend, tell me the secret to like, okay, I'm so ugly. Tell me the secret to like how a boyfriend works. Um, I know that all boyfriends are different, but like how do you not hit them? Because like I'm not an abusive person, but sometimes I'm just like, boy the fuck um and i know he watches these videos and that's fine but like sweetie honey bug all my nicknames oh oh my gosh i can't i'm i can't talk anymore i'm gonna say something that i don't want to but i don't know i'm just it was a day and I'm not, like, saying, like, my boyfriend, like, it was a day with him. It was just, like, a day in general. And, like, now I'm taking my makeup off. And, like, I can't, I was going to vlog at the, the, um, place I'm doing the show, but they don't have good lighting. Um. Oh, my gosh. What even are boys? Like, I'm sure girls aren't any better, but, like, ugh! I look so good and anyone who says otherwise can like literally kiss my butt that's how my day went it was good but I was just like off because my infusion and like <sighs> I just I want to go home I'm at my grandparents right now in the guest bedroom I want to go home and just like punch my punching bag because that's what I do after every day. And like that's how every day should end. And like I know like oh, that's masculine blah blah blah. But like literally like I don't care. I always do what I want to do. I think I got it all. I hope you guys had a good day. I had a good day. It's just sometimes like things just annoy me. And certain people know they annoy me, but still do them. Just to, like, see me aggressively take off my eye makeup. Oh, get over yourself, Zoe. Okay? I am over myself. And look, I'm so over myself that I'm talking to a camera. <laughs> literally so ugly and like fat and gross and this is like kind of turning into a very negative video and I'm not for it but at the same time I don't really I don't know I'm not a negative person like overall it was a good day I'm not trying to make this into like a rant video it's just like the little things today are like piling up and it's just like I don't know with the whole like scale thing and me like wanting affection I don't know I was waiting for the other shoe to drop anyways I'm gonna go take a shower or something I don't know I have to study my script this weekend and I'll figure it out but I'm tired it's like almost 12 it's 11:45. <laughs> okay
Okay, I'm gonna go. We out here. I look. <laughs> I can't see. Look at the duckies. And the sky. Wow, I'm famous. It's in the script. I'm I so zoomed on your face. I know. I love that shirt. Thank you. We got here early to meditate. I meditated for the first time today. I was like, oh. I, no, you like, didn't. I totally didn't. No, you that. didn't. I, I'll show you my Spotify, <laughs> my Spotify, like, recently played. Like, I totally did. <laughs> Going to hell. <laughs> I know. And then <laughs> I did yoga. Your I totally mom, did, you did I yoga. I did, like, yoga and, like, like a five-minute warm-up thing from, like, YouTube. Mm. I'm just, like, flipping my hair. Uh, I can tell. Yoga and meditation. <laughs> I follow that one, too. Of course I do, but... Oh, and then Once on the Islands thing is now being able to be streamed. I just look wet. This is, um, I just ate some of it because you left it here and I can't go across the street with the adults to get drinks and food. I mean, I can, but I don't want to go alone. And also I have to be up super early, but this is our green room and no one's in here, so I'm totally vlogging in it. You can get a little tour. Uh, we used this for Sister Act and like Queen, someone killed a Smurf. This is my dress. Look how cute it is. It's very warm or moist because like <clears throat> sweating. Uh, and yeah, I'm eating a french fry. I think this is Chelsea's. Some of the flowers too. I'm gonna take so much of people's things that leave. I'm kidding. I won't actually do that. That's stealing. But um, don't know who that is. It's so like. Yes, but opening night went well. It's dark. <laughs> 